Jezebel and we're back with another Sacred Spaces tour. This time we are still on Antonia Vale. Actually, honestly, most of the contestants were on Antonia Vale, so it makes sense. And we are looking at Vishane's entry. This is an Everfrost summer home in Freeport. And it's actually located under the Hall of Fame already because uh, this was a previous temple build that Vishane took down to tweak to the specifications of the Sacred Spaces entry. So it's already in the Hall of Fame um, and it is the Temple to Drinal. Drinal? Drinal? I always say Drinal. So too bad you guys are going to get to hear me say Drinal if it's wrong. It's wrong. So that's Temple to Drinal, SS 2015, under the Hall of Fame by Vishane. If you missed any of that information, it is in the lower left-hand corner of the screen. So here we are to visit the temple. wait for it to load. i be a horrible person to pull up the web page in the background. <laughs> okay, here we are, loading in. Ooh, that was quite the entrance there. I don't feel very welcome with that going on. <laughs> Pretty cool. Alright, zoom in so we can... Ooh. I guess I just got it perfectly timed. That was neat, having them both go off at once. Very nice. And I got it on video. So this is a very Drunalian place, very ever near. Nice job. The uh, Stone of Adoration is perfect in here and it goes very well with the other near tiles. Um, and the other near tiles, using them as accents rather than uh, having them be the focus really works very nicely for this space. So there's the seating off to the sides for the specified seating. And, oh. and a lot of, you know, it's, it's very nicely done as far as I like how the adamantine column was used to create a pillar base for these, I uh, never remember their names, the focus crystals, which I adore by the way. I need to find something to do with them because they are so perfect. Anyway, moving on, enough gushing. What is this? This is, oh, the back of a bookcase. They made a very nice background, of a stone background for the uh, Janalian statue right here. The monolith of the silver reaper. And then I like how she used the um, the railings here. I think these are railings. Yep. The railings of Ebonier. I figured they were the railings because the uh, the text on them was so much larger. So it made sense. I like how she used the railings for the steps. It's um, with the, the scale of the other near set the way it is makes the runes not overwhelming. Sometimes they can be a little overwhelming when you use too many of them, but this is a nice accent. And then to build the, the altar piece out of the Flames of the Silver Reaper, which yes, I did have to stop and take a look. Oh, oh, and I saw this, I saw this on a screenshot that she posted to Home Show. Watch this. Is that not the coolest ever? Hiding the column in there so that when you click on it, you suddenly have Journal's head talking to you? That is so perfect. Isn't it? Oh, and then there's some more right here. So that's, lo that's a lovely accent to have that there. So nice. So this is a very small space. Um, but it has all that it's required to have. Uh, wait. I'm missing a book. 
here it is. How did I miss that? There it is. So yeah, there is an entire lore book there for this, this temple. So awesome job. And does this do anything special? No. Very nice. I love how it all came together. Good job, Shane. Um, since it's such a small space, there really isn't much more I can say or do. I mean, I like I like this echoed the the circle above and the circle below. And oh, I didn't. Th I don't think I mentioned this, but the choice of the Everfrost home as the home that that um, she used for it is very very nice because while it is a larger home, uh, the the lighting in it works very well for this. And then you add in the, oh, no breath. What happened to my cold breath? Is it because I'm a, uh, a free blood? I swear I used to breathe cold air in. Oh, there. I, oh, no, that's my, my armband. Okay, I'm not going to waste any more of your time staring at it and hoping that I breathe frosty air. Yeah, that's it, I think. Come see it for yourself. It's definitely very Denalian and definitely worth a visit. And if you visit, give it a thumbs up. Best of luck to you in the judging, Vishane, and thank you for participating in the Sacred Spaces 2015 contest. We hope to see other things you produce.